Chair recognizes Mr. Zeldin to talk about his bill. Thank you, Mr. Chairman. I speak today in favor of H.R. 1569. I appreciate you bringing it up for the committee's consideration. In our current system, many of our veterans have earned service-related benefits due to injuries sustained on the battlefield. Those benefits, however, can only pass to a small group of individuals should the veteran pass away. If that veteran does not have a qualifying family member and passes away, the VA recoups the benefits that rightfully belong to the veteran. The VA has struggled to complete timely reviews of claims, and if a veteran passes away while the VA is still reviewing a claim, the VA no longer has to award the earned benefits. H.R. 1569 would require the VA to pay certain benefits that were earned by a veteran to the veteran's estate. Currently, only a veteran spouse, minor child, or dependent parent or parents are eligible to collect the accrued benefits. By adding the estate to the current list of beneficiaries, adult children can now also receive the benefits earned should there be no other qualifying family members. Service members should be able to share the benefits they have earned with their families. This bill ensures that the benefits a veteran earns during his or her service stays with their family. Further, with the addition of this piece of legislation, the VA can no longer avoid awarding a claim to a veteran due to slow processing time. Not only will this bill protect the benefits that our veterans have earned, but it will also help maintain stricter levels of accountability at the VA. I yield back the balance of my time. 